find some. Yeah, yeah. Okay. How do you find the lectures? This is a bit of a dodgy question. <laughs> <laughs> I chose to study fashion uh, because from a very young age I've enjoyed looking at fashion and I've always had an interest in it and uh, how things are made, how things come together. Um, there's not a lot out there for a bigger bloke, so I thought I'd give it a crack myself, see if I can make my own stuff, see if I can be a bit more fashionable instead of wearing just old fuddy-duddy stuff. I like ordering stuff, I like buying stuff and then just making it fit myself. Why did I choose to study fashion? Always been interested in fashion, always been Dying to learn how to design clothes, make clothes, make patterns. I always want to know more about the industry. So I just really enjoy fashion. I think it's just a good, interesting subject. I want to be different. I want to come and change the aspect of it and, you know, really broaden my horizons on how fashion works and where it begins and where it starts and where it ends and how to get into the fashion industry. And so far, I feel like I've gained quite a lot of knowledge about that. So my biggest achievement in the fashion industry is going from a student in Ayrshire College um, to I now have a small business and I'm working as a temporary lecturer at Ayrshire College. Um, I studied HND fashion and then I went on to work in community arts teaching fashion based subjects for a few years and then um, that came through from doing a work experience while I was a student at Ayrshire College so I was really lucky um, that it sort of guided my path from being here from a student and then I went after working that for three years I went and done an honours degree in fashion design and manufacture. The fashion department is actually quite a good place to be there um, it's quite fun and friendly they, they encourage you to be creative um, it's hard work I'm not gonna lie but it's, it's good it's good you get a lot out of it you learn stuff that you didn't well you didn't think was like part of fashion from like business side of things, how things are made, where they come from, where the fabrics come from, where everything basically to start to the, from the little idea in your head all the way through to be sold on the shelf. So yeah, it's great. It's just a very, very interesting and creative place to be. Environments, depending on where you are and what stages you're at of the course, it's, it can be fun majority of the time, but also it's hard work and it's, you've got to get your head down and, suck it up and really push to stay in your deadlines and be as best as you can be. But in general, the environment is great to be around. I mean, the equipment, the, the things you're learning, it's, it's, it's a fun environment to be in. Just as long as you make it a fun environment to be in and you're concentrated and you're up to date with everything, it's, it's a good place to be. The lecturers in the department are generally pretty good. They're very knowledgeable. They know what they're talking about. Some of the lecturers have got years of experience and some of like Anne is a font of all knowledge so she's the one to go to. I have an honours degree, I studied at Glasgow Kelvin College but it was through Manchester Metropolitan University. Um, during the degree I looked at different sort of um, styles of fashion, I was really interested in sustainable fashion. I made a collection fully in leather from factory offcuts um, and I now specialise in leather. Yeah, so they've got their, their expertise in certain subjects but they're generally, as a whole, they're brilliant. They just want you to pass, they just want to be better, they just want to be the best you can be, and I feel like they push you towards being like that, and it's brilliant to be around. They're really helpful and creative, and they encourage you to reach your full potential. For those that are interested in studying fashion, it's, you should, I advise you to come along to Ayrshire College, find out a bit more about the course. The lecturers are always willing to speak to people and tell them a bit more about it. We have specific um, open evenings and open days where you can find out more information, speak to some of the students that are currently studying. Um, I think it's always a good idea. You don't have to be able to have the skills already to come along, but maybe if you look at sort of how you can upcycle clothes or DIY them or small changes you can make um, and you can start building a small portfolio that way.